Hi all and welcome. This is Julia from the Australian Field View team. Today I'm going to run through the Field View Cab app, which once downloaded on your iOS devices will appear as a white icon. On the home page, you will see the email account that your account is associated with, as well as the cloud sync button to make sure that your data cloud syncs when you have internet connection. On the map screen, you'll be able to see when you're mapping a application, planting or harvest when a field view drive is connected. You can also go in and see previous activities. And look at the layers such as the yield layer. You can also export uh, harvest summaries, drop field pins or create field region reports. In the Equipments tab, you can edit existing equipment and add new pieces of equipment. You can also remote view to see where your equipment is in the field. In the Fields tab, you can add varieties and application tank mixes that are associated with your particular fields to make the planning easier when you go to do activities. In settings, you can change general account settings such as enabling cloud sync. In data, you can send field data based on the year you've selected, as well as adding manual layers. Devices is where you see current drives that are connected, as well as adding new or disconnecting drives. You can also add varieties and applications as well as view prescriptions and change your notification settings. For example, if you want a notification when your moisture is high. In the help tab, you can submit tickets to the support team when you're having an issue with the CAB app. You can also go in and see help articles on our Knowledge Centre. You can view your cloud sync status to make sure all of the data in each of your fields has cloud synced, as well as see the version info of your app and the privacy statements. The analysis tab is where you can see yield, planting and application data for various years, as well as share this data via PDF or CSV. Thank you, I hope you found this helpful.